Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to the first edition of the Wild Art News. Uh, I actually thought this would be a bit of fun uh, and a good way to keep everybody up to date regularly with what's happening with Wild Art, because obviously there's there's always something happening, as you know, um, with the 10 categories running over 10 months and all the other bits and pieces that we're doing. So I thought rather than just keep sending emails, which I'll continue to do, obviously, but this might be a fun way of, uh, of, of keeping everybody up to date. So um, what's new? Um, first thing to say is, well, let me bring up a banner first because they're, they're quite good fun. Um, so I'll bring that up. Uh, the first thing to say is that uh, I have, uh, from the printer this week, received the pages for the book as they will be. So this this is actually, you know, uh, part of the print run for the internal pages of the book. So there's no cover, but um, I'll quickly quickly show you that if I can. Um, so you'll you'll pretty much see what it is. So that's the standard of the of the printing. Diana Anderson's lovely pied stilt there. Um, uh, Chava Deroxy's wolf spider. Uh, let's get it in the right place. Uh, that's one of the darker images in the book. Uh, Oh, uh, Jerry Hebrushik's um, snow geese. Uh, so there you are. You can see the quality of it. Um, I'm expecting that now uh, in two to three weeks' time. You know, as a completed, as a completed book, all the stock. Um, so now's the time to order that up if you haven't done already. So thanks to those that have. But don't forget that um, you know five pounds of that is going to go to conservation as well. So uh, make sure that uh, you you order that up. Second on the agenda uh, is that. Of course, WET is closing for entries uh, on the 31st of January. So that's only just over a week away. So there's not long left now um, to enter. Uh, as you're all aware, there's a new entry system this year. So you'll have to sign up for that if you haven't already done so. And of course, you don't have to pay uh, any money until you actually enter your images. You can upload into the holding gallery at the front uh, anything that you want to enter into the competition this year and then pay um, you know, once you once you confirm your your entry, and uh, you can buy credits for all the other uh, uh, categories coming up right up front. So you can. It's all about numbers of pictures. So if you bought bought a fifty entry package, for example, and only used five for wet, then you've still got forty five that you can use throughout the course of the year. Uh, so do go onto that. Uh, you know, do go onto the entry system. Uh, onto the website and, and have a look. And if you've got any questions, then let me know. Don't leave it to the last minute. Um, if there are any issues that you need dealing with, obviously it's easier for me to deal with them if I have a little bit of time. So uh, don't leave it to the last minute. Do take a look at that uh, that new entry system now. Uh, so that's where, it, as I said, closing uh, on the 31st. So there's you know just over a week left uh, for that. So make sure you don't miss out. It's going to be a great category. It was last year. Uh, I've seen some of the entries coming in already. Um, it's going to be a fabulous uh, competition again. So uh, so don't miss out on that. Uh, next up is Boca Battles um, with Georgina Statler. Uh, so that's happening on the 6th of February. So we're going to have a bit of fun with that live. Um, and basically, we are going to pitch uh, each choose five images and we're going to pitch those against each other in five sort of ashes rounds, if you like. Uh, and you are going to decide who wins each of those rounds and who ultimately uh, you know, wins that uh, wins that little battle. Um, but all along the way, as we we go through that, uh, as we go through that broadcast, we'll chat about you know, uh, Boca in general and and how you you know and the the best ways of actually you know getting that uh, that element into your images and the secrets behind it. So do make sure that you tune in for that because that's going to be a, you know a re that's going to be really good fun. Uh, and I'll just bring the banner up across the bottom just to show you for a bit of fun. So there we go. So don't don't miss out on that YouTube channel. A Wild Vision, obviously, Boca Battles is going to be part of that. Um, make sure you subscribe to the channel. There'll be these news bulletins placed on there. We'll put them up on Facebook, um, you know, and I'll put them up on the website as well and send everybody a link via email to so you can all catch up. But if you subscribe to the YouTube channel and click the bell icon as well, um, then that will alert you to to new videos as as the, when they come up. So every time I post, which I'm aiming to do every week, just to keep everybody up to date, uh, then you'll get those notifications and and you'll be able to watch the video straight away. So make sure you do that. So that's it. That's it for the first uh, roundup of news. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. It was a bit of fun. Um, look out next week. I'll do the same thing again. Um, just to bring you up to date with everything that's happening at Wild Art. So stay safe, everybody. Uh, don't miss out on wet. Make sure you get your entries sorted for that. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.